All right, guys, this is not even a review. This is more of an advocacy video. You gotta get this Old Forester single barrel. Uh, the one I have, they're all store picks. They are hard to find. I had to meet somebody off a Facebook, a Facebook group to get this. I'm not lucky enough to just randomly, magically be in the store where this is like on the shelves, but I probably paid double. This was probably should be worth like 60 bucks, but anyway, it doesn't matter because it's it's so worth it. If they were to cut the production on this, I'm sure this is be as wanted as like the the B Tac or whatever the like the the Buffalo Trace like antique line. In my opinion, this thing six years old or give or take. And the one thing that I will say is a lot of people put all like just, you know, taste a bourbon and put all sorts of notes on there. Like, oh, this is like tobacco, this is that, whatever. And it just based on their palate and a lot of other people's palate is different. So they're not gonna taste the same thing. But everybody that tastes this and all the reviews that I've seen on this, they all have the same thing in common. They taste like a black cherry, and it's true. I taste the black cherry. It's amazing. It's so good. I love it, man. This is definitely one of my favorites. You gotta get this. So I have it poured here. The nose tastes a little, a little floral. Maybe a little, little, little tobacco on it. Let's get into the palate. Mm. Mm. Yeah, definitely. The black cherry, maybe like a, like a like a like a barrel wood takes over the palate. A little bit of rice spice. You got the little bit of a leather and tobacco on, on the back of the palate as well. And of course, this thing is high proof. I mean, the bottle varies because it's like a single barrel. This is 127. If you like low proof stuff, then yeah, you, this is probably not for you. But if you can handle something this like this proof, absolutely, hands down, get it. 100% uh, recommendation for me. Cheers.